Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to our channel. It's Taylor. And from the title, you can tell today I'm doing the last video in the series, in the Pop of Girl series today. I did Buttercup. I had a lot of fun with this look. To me, Buttercup is very extra, but very grungy. So I did green and I did some graphic liner with some shadow. So yeah, if you guys want to see the other two Pop of Girl looks I did, they will be linked up below or in the description box. And yeah, that's all for the intro. Let's see. Let's move on to the video to see how I got this look. So again, to me, Buttercup screams very grungy, very goth, very e-girl, heavy blush, heavy liner. And yeah, so that's what I try to show off in this look. <laughs> so I've already done my brows off camera. If I look a little purple, it's my sunscreen. I don't know what happened, but we're going to start with base today instead of eyes for once. To prep my skin, I'm using a little bit of MAC Fix Plus, and then I'm going to be going in with the NYX Born to Glow Foundation. I am in the shade Deep. For concealer, I'm using the ELF Hydrating Camel Concealer in the shade Rich Cocoa. Also, to brighten up a little bit, I'm taking another shade, which is in Deep Cinnamon. I'm going to set my under eye with the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder. I have the shade Dark. I'm just setting my under eyes for now. I'll set the rest of the face later. I'm using a cream blush, so that's why I want to set the face right now. Even though I'm looking very shiny. Which is a benefit for me because I have dry skin. For shadow, I'm using the e.l.f. by size eyeshadow palette in the shade or style hot jalapeno. Now I'm taking the shade next to it and using that to blend out the darker shade. For some graphic liner. For a little bit of graphic liner, I'm taking this sparkly green shade right here. Using some Kiss Glue liner to apply my lashes. This is way quicker and way easier. For blush, I'm taking two blushes starting off with the cream blush. I'm using the Canmade Cheek and Lip Gel in the shade number six. I'm going to set that with the NYX Sweet Cheeks blush in the shade Red Riot. So guys, this is it for the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this look, but also the other two looks I did in this series. If you guys want to see me recreate or any more inspired looks, then let me know down below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and bye guys! I'm a